Welcome to Kudzu's World of Adventure. I'm Jack. I'm Justin. And this is Kudzu. Today we'll be doing a simple backpacking trip through some country in the Appalachian Mountains that we've never seen. Let's take a look at our route. We're on some private property just outside the Smoky Mountains. We'll start at the very bottom on a road, then take the top of a ridge line into a dark valley. We'll cut our way through the valley until we reach a dry creek bed on the side. We'll climb up the creek bed into the mountain road, which we'll follow until it drops down to the side flat where we've camped before. After a quick granola bar lunch, we'll set up camp, <clears throat> then leave the packs armed with only a machete and a pellet gun to explore the backside of the mountain where we hope to find a complex of creeks. Later that evening, we'll return for dinner and spend the night. On Sunday, we'll go back to the road for extraction by vehicle and head straight to the Taco Bell here. Machete, first aid kit, five piece eating kit, MSR cup, pug, fuel, surefire flashlight, mini shovel. It's a child. Pancake mix, potatoes and cheese with broccoli, bug spray. Alright, we're all packed up. Let's head out to the mountains. Alright, it's uh, 10.38 on Saturday, and we're here at our starting point. We're headed up into those woods up there, and around up to the top of the mountain. followed an old path on the ridge line towards the valley. This is where we are. That's where we're going. When we reached the end of the path, we headed down a kudzu covered slope to the valley. We got that much more of this until we can even start to go up. Or we'll be in that. Finally, we stopped for a break. <coughs> Next was the climb up the creek bed. It was a tough, vertical, rocky climb. Fortunately, we had Kudzu, the world's greatest climbing pug, with us, and after two long hours, we made it to the top.
Well, it took a couple hours, but uh, finally up here at the uh, road that we're supposed to meet up with. In a minute, we'll head along the road to find our old campsite and, uh, and then on into the unexplored area. Come on, Kudzu. You. you can do it. As planned, we set up camp, had lunch, and set out into the valley below without the packs. But Kudzu is still a bit tired from the climb. Alright, we made it from camp down to the creek, and we're going to follow it that way a little bit and uh, see what's back there. We found the creek we were looking for, so we continued through the dense foliage, but it was no match for our S.E. light machete. We took our time at the bottom of the creek before making the climb back to camp. Again, Kudzu needed some encouragement. But when we got back, he got a well-deserved hammock nap. Well, we just got back to camp from the creek, and we've got some time left over, so we decided to try to build a fire. To do so, we're going to be using the Ultimate Survival Technologies Survival Kit, which contains a signal mirror, two wet fire fire starting tenders, the jet scream whistle, which is supposedly one of the loudest whistles in the world at 122 decibels, and a chainsaw, and finally a blast match, which is what we're using to try to start the fire. So right now, Justin's gathering some firewood and tinder, and uh, we're going to see if we can get a good fire going. All right, we've got our pit dug and a nice stack of wood, so we're going to go ahead and try to start this fire. Our survival kit and blast match, available at Cheaper Than Dirt, worked perfectly. We had a bright blaze going in no time. That meant we could focus our attention on tea. Dinner was potatoes with cheese and broccoli, eaten, of course, with our five piece utensil kits provided by Cheaper Than Dirt. Each contains a fork, a spoon, a can opener, a corkscrew, and a locking blade knife. They're available for $4.97 at CheaperThanDirt.com. Also from Cheaper Than Dirt were our sleeping bags. Sleeping bags. We have our uh, Eagle Defense 4 5 degree military bag from, from our friends at Cheaper Than Dirt. It's compact. It's warm. It's just an all around great buy if you're going to be camping. But right before nightfall, we got word that it was about to rain. So we waterproofed our things and prepared for the worst. We've got our... Uh... We're putting on our pack covers on our packs, setting him in the hammock with all our waterproof things, and uh, we're putting everything else that we don't want to get wet inside the tent. It was going to be a long night. Alright, it's uh, morning, and we're going to make some tea. We had a little bit of rain last night, but nothing too bad. And uh, sleeping bags kept us really warm and dry. Got some instant Bisquick pancake mix. Now for your education, we at Kudzu's World of Adventure are going to show you how to not flip a pancake.
that's how you flip a pancake, cut through the world of adventure style. Mmm, good pancakes. Well, we had some nice pancakes for breakfast, and uh, we're going to clean up and uh, pack up and then head out to the extraction point. we our campsite, and uh, we're going to be walking up to the top there where we'll meet with the car and head to Taco Bell. We made it to the end. Uh, here's the car. Let's go have some Taco Bell.